What is going on guys, my name is Medic, and today I'm going to be playing Defiance on the PC. I picked it up on the Steam Summer Sale today, so let's play. Alright. Alright, we're going to skip the introductions. Alright, so there are four different characters that you can choose from. I think I'm gonna go human male. I think I'm gonna go with the outlaw or the veteran. I'm gonna go with the veteran. All right, archetype. I like this look. All right. Alright, skin color, looks about good, eye shape, color, eyebrows, alright, hairstyle, can you confirm? Um, I'm gonna make it live medic. Great character. Alright. Oh, you can't have spaces. Alright. All one word. Yes. Now, Arkunner. Hold on, Captain. That one isn't wearing your beloved uniform. Alright, I'm gonna skip this too, so we can get started. All right. You can interface with me to signal when you're ready to proceed. Let's try it. Except. We need to find Mr. Von Bach, but first right. we'll need to gear up. Shift is to run. Bring up the map. Von Bach Industries had personal defense technologies aboard the Strato carrier. I placed a marker on our map where we'll find some. Okay, sounds good. Excellent. Press Once you equip that, it will allow me to activate the shield. All right. Put the shield on. The there we right. go. We're going to need another weapon option. I'm picking up a signal from a crash. Find a weapon armor. right here. Good, good. Let's hurry. We need to collect this guy. equipment as soon as possible so we can start looking for Mr. Von Bach. According to my oh. rules, those creatures are actually humans. However, their DNA is severely mutated. Okay, that's a fill ammo station. And we're gonna wanna go down here to get a weapon. Alright, sounds good. Alright, so we're gonna head down here. This game's pretty cool so far. I like the graphics. Pretty good. Alright. Um, some guys over here. Quickly pick off these guys. Oh, okay. That's the new guy. Alright, I think they keep spawning, so I'm just gonna go get the weapon. I'm not sure at the bottom if that's your XP bar or what it's supposed to be. It says level 10, I think, in the top corner. If I'm not mistaken. Alright. Alright. 
Quick to weapon. Alright. That is my primary. Secondary. Alright. Particular weapon types work better for specific situations, so you'll want to get used to switching back and forth between the primary and secondary weapons. I'm detecting some explosives nearby. We could definitely use those. I've put the location on the map. Alright, so we gotta go get a frag grenade. So a lot of these spiders. They're really annoying. I'm liking this so right. It's pretty awesome. Alright. And the recoil is not too bad on it actually. Alright. Alright, so now we're gonna search the supply pod for a grenade. Alright, now we gotta equip it. Grab one and equip it. Alright. Good to go. Mission complete. Sweet. Alright, yeah, so my XP bar leveled up at the bottom, so that's good. Ego power. When using cloak, you are completely invisible to enemies. That's Use the cool. power to sneak up behind the projections and attack. Now we'll test the overcharge power. While using overcharge, your damage inflicted on the enemy is significantly increased. Shoot the projection while the overcharge is activated. Alright. Did not mean to do that. Wanted to use the ego power. I gotta wait. I'll enable the decoy power now. Decoy allows us to create a projection in your likeness that will fool and distract the enemy. Take down the projections while they're distracted by your decoy. Alright. The blur power is now enabled. Blur will allow us to move at extreme speeds and increases melee strength during close combat. With blur active, rush the projections and strike them with melee attacks. One more. Ooh, I gotta wait for that. Alright. Good work. You'll need to choose an ego power for me to integrate. I think I'm gonna choose the invisor, this one, the speed. Speed is pretty helpful. Alright, let me take out these enemies. Alright, it's one, it's another, another one right there. Don't mess with me. Don't for you to die. Alright. So, I think, personally, I'm going to go with Blur or Cloak. I'm gonna go with Cloak. Nice All right. choice. Stealth is the best power for surprise and subtlety. I'm receiving a signal. I'll patch it through. Can you run Can the invis? Yep. I need help down here. That's nice. Like you want this for 15 for seconds. No, we better help her. That regenerates pretty fast, the ego that I have. Alright. Looks like another player. Yep. There are a lot of enemies. Alright, got these guys. I'm over here. Those two guys. Get to that thorium reactor, and I'll see what I can do. Oh, that's awesome! You don't have to like buy extra grenades; they just regenerate over time. That's helpful. Need him back up. Go in this. Use it to our advantage. You don't need to. All right. 
interface with reactor. I think I have to activate it, yep. Alright. Protect the reactor. The reactor is overloaded. Sim Viz is really helpful. Starting to run out of ammo on my gun. Should probably switch over to my secondary. Sounds good. Alright. It's not as powerful, but it gets the job done. It's the important thing. Almost there. Keep those mutants away from the reactor. Skip it now. So far, the graphics, uh, I'm actually pretty impressed with them. It's a pretty nice game. Alright. Alright, so this is gonna wrap up my first episode of Defiance Let's Play. If you guys enjoyed this video, be, be sure to leave a like rating below. It helps my channel grow a lot, and I would really appreciate it if you could also leave a like. It would also help a ton. So, until next time, I'll see you guys.